Welcome to College Candidates by Campus Bound. This is Babson College. Would you first just introduce yourself and give us a quick overview of Babson? Babson is a small business school that focuses truly entrepreneurship. So we're about 2,500 undergraduates. We are 30% international. Uh, about 90% of our students come from outside of Massachusetts. Uh, most come from outside of New England as well. So even if Babson is local for you, it's truly a very global experience to join Babson. All of our students have the same degree, so all of them earn a general Bachelor of Science. So you'll be studying business, but half of your credits will be in business and half will be in the liberal arts as well. So we really make sure that you get that kind of traditional experience, that foundation in business. But our focus being entrepreneurship, we teach our students to really think like an entrepreneur. So whether it's an area that you'll go into yourself and you aspire to be an entrepreneur, have your own business, we teach our students to think that way and be comfortable with the element of risk and failure and the highs and lows that come with entrepreneurship, but also just being someone that can look at a situation critically, ask questions, come up with creative solutions, and be someone that's really a, a champion for social and economic change. Could you describe Babson's student body in three words? Global, entrepreneurial, and passionate. Um, I think our students are, are so passionate about so many different things. Um, we we're you know, chatting earlier just about how students have um, you know, such, they all have that interest in entrepreneurship and business coming to Babson, and it's rare to have a school that has one particular kind of narrow focus. Um, but what we see is that our students have so many varied reasons for being interested in entrepreneurship, whether it is their own business, whether it's a family business they'll return to, um, or whether they're going into an area like finance that you might not necessarily associate with entrepreneurship, but they have just that kind of passion and flair for, you know, thinking critically and differently. Other than taking a formal tour, what are some a couple things that you might recommend students do when they are either visiting or researching a college. If you're interested in talking with someone on the admission staff, I would highly recommend a virtual interview. Uh, we are conducting those daily right now, right through November. And if you do miss the window for that, or if you're more interested in an alumni interview, that's also a great option. Those will be virtual this year as well. Uh, but we typically try to match you with someone from your local area so that you could ask someone what their Babson experience was like and have that kind of twofold experience in your interview. Um, can you talk a little bit about how you feel like um, a college essay should be written um, and some maybe that have really resonated with you or some tips and tricks? <laughs> what I always say about the essay is try to make it something that's really personal to you and a story that only you could tell. Um, and I know at this point, I think sometimes that college essay advice can get a little bit trite and it's hard to really quantify, um, but I've heard this example used before and I loved it that if you were in school and you dropped your college essay on the ground and it didn't have your name on it, would someone be able to pick it up and know that it was yours? And I think that that's a great way of kind of explaining that it should really be a story that only you could tell. So even if it's a story that feels like an experience that many students could have had, like maybe it's related to sports or a family member or something that you feel like is an experience maybe some of your peers have had, get into the detail of it and what makes it so unique to you. 